Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this Shocker Impact Cushion Hitch with the Clevis Pinball Mount for the 2 inch hitch receivers. It has a 12,000 pound gross towing weight capacity. Now this is a shock absorbing ball mount. It uses the bumper stop technology to help reduce any road shock, provide a more comfortable towing experience. And this does install into a two inch by two inch trailer hitch receiver. Now to secure it in your receiver, it does require a hitch pin and clip to go through this hole here. Now the hitch pin and clip is not included. We do sell those separately on our website. If you already have one, you can use it as long as it's a 5 8 inch diameter pin. Now we do also like to recommend for extra security, we do have a lock set that will include three pins and locks. And what you can do is put one through here to lock the ball mount to the vehicle. And then you can place these two pins with two locks and that will lock the ball or the clevis pin mount to the ball, ball mount. That part number we do sell separately on our website. It's listed on this product page as a related product and it's part number IR39FR. Now this channel mount is designed to pivot up against these dual bump stops up at the top here and that's to absorb the road shock and provide a nice smooth toe. It pivots on this large bolt right here and what's nice about it if you look on the other side of the bolt they do have a grease zerk fitting installed on the end of the bolt and that's to allow you to hook a grease gun to there and pump grease into there to lubricate that bolt for easy maintenance. The channel style mount will include this clevis pinball mount here. You can see it has the two tangs on it with the two holes in it. Those diameter holes are one and a quarter inches. And that's to accommodate a variety of towing needs. The clevis pin will drop through there to hold your attachment in place. Now the clevis pin is not included. We do sell that separately. Overall height on these two tangs from the bottom to the very top. If we put a ruler on that is going to be right at four and three quarter inches. The inside height from the top here to the bottom of the top one is three and a quarter inches and also the measurement from the center of these hitch pin holes to the center of the clevis pin hole. If we take the front hole center to center is 11 inches. If you use the rearmost hole center to center is 12 inches. So this attachment is perfect for use on farm equipment, wagons, fertilizer spreaders, balers, auger sprayers and other agricultural related equipment trailers or more. This is a nice solid heavy duty adjustable channel mount. You can see it has seven holes for adjustment which gives you a range of adjustability to tow trailers of various heights. The distance between those holes center to center is one inch. And this mount can be flipped around to use in the rise position if you want. Right now it's in the drop position. Now the measurement you'll get, the measurement on the drop position will be measured from the top of the shank to the top of this lower tang. So if we put it in, the, it's not in the lowest position, if we put this in the lowest drop position, it would get you a drop of about five and a half inches. If you flip this around and put this in the uh, rise position, it would get you a maximum rise of about one and a half inches. Now to move this ball mount, it's pretty easy. You can see it has these easy to remove ball mount pins and clips. You can see they have a large D-ring handle on them, makes them very easy to grip. No more fumbling with a small hitch pin head. And over here they have the nice large safety clips, makes securing the pins pretty easy. And just to show you how to move that, what I'm going to do, pull out the first clip, pull out the second clip. So now all we have to do is slide our pins out, slide our first pin out, <clears throat> Slide our second pin out and you can see it releases the clevis ball mount and it's separate now. So you can put that into whatever height you need. You can flip it over to use it in the rise position and you can even flip this over to use in the rise position. But basically what you'll want to do is when you install this, just line it up. There's two holes. So just line up like that. Slide the pin through and there's a bottom hole. Slide that pin all the way through. That'll hold it in place and then to secure it, just pop in the clips. Clip right on there and the clip right on there. And just like that, you can see it's secure. So it's very easily adjustable. <clears throat> now this channel mount will work with all the shocker hitch ball mounts and attachments. You can put in a standard mount, a drop mount, a pinto hook, and many others that we do sell. And they are sold separately on our website. Inside width of this channel is three and three quarter inches. This is a nice grade 50 steel plate construction, uses a cold rolled steel shank, provides maximum durability. Does have a nice premium powder coat finish on the channel mount, on the shank, and on the clevis ball mount, clevis pin mount. Now this part is made in the USA. 
application. This is for two inch by two inch trailer hitch receivers. Gross towing weight capacity of 12,000 pounds and a tongue weight capacity of 1,200 pounds. But that should do it for the review on the Shocker Impact Cushion Hitch with the Clevis Pinball Mount for two inch hitch receivers.